We're at the birthplace of a prophet of God. A prophet to give us the fullness of the everlasting gospel of Jesus Christ. Well, it's typical to me of the way the Lord seems to do things uh, out of very humble circumstances. And in this spot, very small home, and there is born a babe who will change the course of history. For me, it's a very humbling experience when I think that a great, great uncle is the prophet Joseph Smith. The restoration and the beginnings of the work in this dispensation is not that far in the, in the past. Right. You're not that old. Yeah. Well, I'm 91 <laughs> now. I know, but, but they we're connected to, <laughs> to all of that uh, by someone who's living today. I've got the bust of Joseph F. Smith and Joseph and Hiram, and I look at them and I, I think I hear them say, get going, boy, do something worthwhile. Tell the world what's happened. So, to me, I get uh, nudged big time when I see them and see what they did and the, what they gave, then I feel obligated to do everything I can to declare and to teach that the fullness of the gospel of Jesus Christ is once again upon the earth. And that's because in this little cottage, on December 23rd, 1805, a little boy was born named Joseph. <laughs>